husband Jason and I have been married for one year. I've been obsessed with his ex-girlfriend for two. I guess on some level I've sort of been stalking her. The occasional drive-by with my sister, the showing up when I see her car outside La Pan Cotidian. I don't really know what compels me to do these things. I guess I just want to make sure she has a good life without Jason. We've never actually met in person, but we've come really close. You better hurry, you're gonna lose her. God, can't this drone go any faster? Remind me again, why do we care about this chick? I mean, isn't the fact that she's Jason's ex enough? Well, I'm not attracted to Jason. And I'm not attracted to your husband. And he's not attracted to you. And Jason's not attracted to you. Well, anyway, I don't understand. This girl's not a threat. You're married to Jason. I don't think she's a threat. I feel badly for her. And not just because she only has 20 Instagram followers. Jason's famous, okay? And breaking up with a celebrity is never easy. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. He is the third lead on a television show about an all-girls Catholic school. It's not exactly famous. I mean, it pretty much is. Shit, Jenny, you're too close. You have to pull no, 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 up. I'm trying. Get, I'm trying. Get higher. You're too close. Jenny. Ah! Ah! Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Jenny, she's down. She's down. You hit her in the back of the head. I think she's dead. I'm pretty sure she's dead. Oh, my God. Get it. Oh, 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 oh. Hold up. I can't. It's stuck. I can't move it. Go. Go. Run. Run. Come on. Okay, I got it. Got it. I got it. I got it. Maybe I can get it to... Yes. Keep going. Slow, 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 slow. Okay, it's coming, it's coming. Ah! I got it! Who oh, got it? it? Uh, Jason, you never know that this happens. What are you gonna give me? I want a shrimp salad from Fred Siegel. I just bought you a shrimp salad from Fred Siegel. Well, I want another one, Jenny. Oh my God, just clean that thing within an inch of his life and I won't tell anyone else you have HPV. You told people that I have HPV? Only other people with HPV to make them feel less alone. Oh God, you are the worst. Ugh. Uh, Jenny, Jen, Jen, can you come here for a second, please? Yeah, baby. What's up? Looks like Baz was in the hospital. Concussion. Uh, apparently, she was hit in the head with a drone outside her apartment. That's weird. You still follow her on Facebook. Jenny, where's your drone? I'm sorry, what? I told you. And frankly, I'm a little offended that Jenny, you... there is blood all over this thing! Okay, fine, it was me. But I didn't mean to hurt her. Why were you even following her? I wasn't! The drone was. Okay, Jenny, I don't even know what to say. I mean, what do, what do people say when their wives drive remote-controlled devices into their ex-girlfriend's heads? This morbid curiosity, it has to stop, okay? I, I have to go apologize. You're right, we do. Not we, I, me, you. Can I, can I drive you? No! I felt awful about what I had done to Baz, but unfortunately, my Botox prevented me from showing it. Part of me wanted to go to apologize, and part of me wanted to go to see if I disfigured her in any way. But Jason said no, and since he's my husband, I had to respect his wishes. I mean, sure, it was a little disconcerting that he was going to be alone with his ex in an apartment that they once shared together. What the fuck? But we were married, which meant that eventually, I was going to have to learn to trust him. She can get a little kooky, yes, but uh, it's meant with love. I know that, I know that sounds ridiculous, but uh, whatever. Anyway, um, I'm really sorry. I hope you're okay. I'm good. So, we're good? Mm-hmm, we're fine. Great, okay. Uh, so how you doing? Obviously, I've been better. That's great. Good. Okay, well, anyway, I should get going. So, um, again, sorry. She really is an amazing person. Really? Because she kind of seems like a fucking psycho. I'm sorry? No, you heard me. Psycho? Jenny. Mm-hmm. That's funny, because you know what I think is psycho? You kicking a hole in my car door when I told you it was over. You remember that? Or what about not telling me for a whole year that you have an ex-wife? <laughs> 
Oh, you know what else I think is psycho? You pretending to be diabetic so you can get one of those metal bracelets. That's fucking weird. Oh my God. You still send my mother birthday presents. You, you use my last name to get restaurant reservations. I got a call the other night from Animal. And don't even get me started on the whole mysterious IMDB comments complaining about how I've gained weight. You have! Okay, Jenny is not the psycho. You are the psycho. Jenny is normal. Jenny. Jenny! I'm so lucky I found a man like Jason who's attracted to psychos. But we all have our obsessions, even Jason. And as an actor, there's nothing that irritates him more than another actor. Maybe I have gained weight. He, he looks nothing like me. I agree. I can't believe he steals parts from me. Wait, you, you think he looks thinner than me? In like the worst possible way, baby. I mean, the guy probably has cancer. You're sick. Fuck do I love you. Uh. Oh, sh- Oh, sh- Oh! Oh, God. Uh. That's go, not go, good. Go, That's go, not go. good. This way, this way. Ah! Your brains, madam.